Hey guys, welcome to my channel Top Flight Classes. In this video, we will solve the fourth part of question number one of exercise 3.6. Now, question number one says solve the following pair of equations by reducing them to a pair of linear equations. Now, the equations that we have are 5 by x minus 1 plus 1 by y minus 2 is equal to 2 and 6 by x minus 1 minus 3 by y minus 2 is equal to 1. So in this case, it is very clear that we have a x minus 1 ka factor and a y minus 2 ka factor. So what do we do? 1 by x minus 1 ko I will put equal to p and 1 by y minus 2 ko I will put equal to q. So from here I will get 5p plus q is equal to 2 this is the first equation and second jo equation hogi that will be 6p minus 3q is equal to 1 that is the second equation now you can see over here this is only 1q this is minus 3q so i can multiply the first equation into 3 and add it with the second equation and jo hamara q variable hai wo eliminate ho jayega so we can use the elimination method over here so we get 15p plus 3q is equal to 6 and from here I have 6p minus 3q is equal to 1. So 3q, 3q gets cancelled over here. From here I will get 21p is equal to when I add this is 7. So from here I will get that p is equal to 1 by 3. Now I'll put this in any one of the two equations. Let us say I put it in 2. So put p in 2. So from there I will get 6 into p that is 6 into 1 by 3 minus 3q is equal to 1. So this is 2 over here. So from here I will get minus 3q is equal to 1 minus 2 which is equal to minus 1. So minus 3q is equal to minus 1. So q comes out to be 1 by 3. So from here in the starting I put 1 by x minus 1 is equal to p. So this implies that 1 by x minus 1 is equal to 1 by 3. This implies that x minus 1 is equal to 3. And from here I get that x is equal to 4. Similarly, 1 by y minus 2 was equal to q. And q is equal to 1 by 3. So 1 by y minus 2 is equal to 1 by 3. So this implies that y minus 2 is equal to 3 so from here i get that y is equal to 5 and that is what is required in this question again you can solve this directly as well you do not need to put 1 by x minus 1 equal to p and 1 by y minus 2 equal to q you can directly also solve by the elimination method so guys thanks for watching the video for any doubt regarding this video or any other topics, you can contact us on email or WhatsApp as shown on the screen. Please like, comment and share this video. For more videos, subscribe to the channel Top Flight Classes and click on the bell icon so you do not miss any updates. Happy learning!